What is going on everyone out there on YouTube? It's the Crazy Gabano here with the very first Let's Play for 2018. And I'm here with a great buddy of mine and the creator of FX, FX Unit, Unit Yuki. Yuki. The one and only Sadu Sadu. What's up guys? What's going on man? So we got the main man, the man behind Retro G Pong and FX Unit Yuki, which is a very awesome game coming out. Very, very soon. Very soon. Yeah. So close. So, I, so close. So close. But how you doing, Sar? How you doing? Good. How you doing, man? I'm doing very good. Thank you for coming along on this adventure with me. And today we're going to be checking out a very awesome game that I recently picked up on the PS4. And they actually re-released this two years ago. And we finally got a physical form of this game after waiting for so long. And that is Battle Greg, as you see here on the screen. This is the attract mode. One of my personal favorite shmup games, originally made in 1996. So we're going to go ahead and check it out, show off some gameplay, and yeah. show off how awesome and how crazy this game can truly be. How hard this game oh, can really yeah. be, because yes. this game is hard as... <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, do you have this on the Saturn, by the way? I do not have this on the Saturn. It's like 200 bucks. Oh, I was man, just like, oh, true. my God. Yeah. It's a 200 dollars game. Very expensive. That's the thing keeping me from getting it is this crazy Very, price. Because I'd like to have this on the Saturn. My, yeah. my earliest memory of this game is on the Saturn. Yeah, so. so I'd like to get it eventually mm -hmm. here. Actually, let's go ahead and uh, go to the option settings real quick. Let's go to the option settings because for some reason, if you want to activate two-player mode in this game, you got to go to the controller settings. Mm. And you have to mess with it a little bit. So let's go ahead and. So, when you go to the controller settings, you have to press triangle and it'll take you to the controller assignment screen. That's what you're going to want to look for. Make sure you have both controllers on each side. And then you can actually play the game with a friend. Yay! So, if you don't remember this, you won't be able to uh, I'm pretty play. sure, didn't this game come out in English on the digital store? Yeah. Oh, okay, so yeah, people but, probably already you know, figured that out. I don't like digital. I like physical. I know. But, you know, you have to. <laughs> That's uh, why we're, right? we're struggling. That's why we're struggling because we're trying to figure it out, and it's it's kind of a hassle. Yeah, but you is. know what? Okay, now let's we'll go ahead and return the game. It's a pain in the ass. <clears throat> return the game. Oh, am I in there? Can I do? Ooh. Oh, what does that mean? I have no clue. Let's just press. Okay. How did I pick the same? Wait, oh no, you're on that side. Okay. Yeah, I'm the red one. Okay, so I have to remember that. Um, as awesome as this game is, there are things flying everywhere, so it's really hard to see yeah. where the enemy bullets are coming from because now that I play this game, I realize that it blends so well with the background, especially when you're playing multiplayer. It's everything. Blends in yeah, so well. you got those. There's like those little missiles. See those those guys right there? They're yeah. like super hard to see. Yeah, especially if you're playing. I mean, it's not so bad when you're playing single player, but when you're yeah. playing with a friend. Dude, I'm blind. Yeah, and especially like the screen moves a lot, so it's kind of tricky. Yeah, that's that's the that's the big kicker is how. See how the screen is moving around when I yeah. move left to right? When you move left to right, it does the same thing. Uh -huh. So it makes it confusing because like you have these missiles coming at you, and then you think you're like you think you're not here, in the way of it, and, and then, then you're then, in like, the way. Bam! Right in the face. Yeah, I was, I was experiencing quite a lot of, quite a bit of that when we were uh, playing this. Yeah, I just got hit. And if the gorgeous one, gorgeous George, if you're watching this, I don't want to hear any shit, okay? No, he's going to give you shit. Yeah, I don't give a damn. I'm going to give him shit right back. Oh! He's going to be like, why do you suck at games? I'm going to be like, I like to game see you play this one. Yeah, this game's hard. Yeah, it's very hard. This game is hard. But it's really good. I mean, the graphics look excellent. The music. That's one of my favorite parts about the game is the music. They did a very good job with the soundtrack. Yeah, and in is. this game, there's like four different variants Damn. of the soundtrack. Oh, we both got killed. Oh my god. That is those here. Oh wait, we didn't right? put enough coins. Oh, oh my god. Yeah, you took the last credit. Oh! oh no! Yeah, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, start over. We're gonna have, we have to put more credits. 
Oh, you you have to do that at the beginning? Yeah, I think so. That's dumb. Right? Here, push your thing. Who is this right now? Oh, I guess that's me. Alright. Let's try that again. Let's, for realsies this time. Yeah. Let's be a little serious with this. Yeah. Try to put more credits in. Because one credit with for two guys? Alright, so... Alright, but... Why is he only giving me three? Might have to change that in the options. Yeah, so what, is that? what are the options? Option, let's change it. Game mode arcade, can you change that? See where it says game mode? Uh huh. Go back? Oh, wait, hold on. Uh, See where it says game mode arcade, can you change that? So that we can. There's super easy premium custom. Custom, no change. Base settings. Okay, premium, no change. I don't understand. I don't know either. What is Rev 2016 Perfect Edition? Oh, that's the soundtrack. So there's oh, okay. four different soundtracks. There's Rev 2016, Original Arcade, Saturn Arranged, and Remix 2016. I don't like the Remix 2016. Ooh, the Saturn one's pretty let's cool. Let's do the Saturn one. I remember yeah, let's that. do the Saturn one. I remember liking the Saturn yeah. Arranged one. Yeah, so you want to just Game leave mode. it custom? Oh, Super easy. Yeah, Ooh. we have to go to custom to change the soundtrack. I think so. Oh, okay. So then base setting. What does premium mean? I do not know. It it's all Korean, so I'm like... Pfft. Custom Sergeant... Blah, 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 blah. Modu. More details. I can't know. All right, well, let's find out. Let's see. Let us see. You want to exchange? Hold on. And then it starts again. Oh, man, what a fun <laughs> Alright, right, let's see how far we can get on a... Apparently three <laughs> credits. I'm be... Let's see how far we can get on three credits. That'll make a good good sized video, I think. Yeah. We'll have to cut some of these. We'll just have to see. Alright, so now we're essentially playing the Sega Saturn version. Since I we chose... Well, we chose the Saturn... Saturn or Yeah, soundtrack. I mean, the graphics were essentially the same. Yeah. Okay, like I said, it's such a shame that this game was only ported on the Saturn. I know. That in, well, that's the reason why this game is 200 bones. Yeah. Because you can only play it on the Saturn. Yeah. Kind of a... Unless you have a main emulator, you can play it there too. Which, honestly... You we'll said just... the E-word! Emulator. I mean, emulator. that's how I found out about this game, was through emulation. Yeah, Saturn was my, my first experience with this game. Yeah. And it was actually a bootleg. Oh, really? Yeah, I used to, um, back in the day, a lot of us used to get these Hong Kong boots. Because uh -huh. they were cheap, you know? And like, yeah. Like, we had mod chips and stuff, and so, like, everyone was buying these bootlegs for, like, 10 bucks a piece. So oh, yeah. We had, like, everything on mm -hmm. Chinese bootleg. And, you know, they pressed them and everything. They were on, like, silver press CDs. Yeah. And they usually came with, like, the inserts and stuff. No booklet. It was just, like, the front cover, the back tray. Yeah, yeah. And it came in an envelope, and you had to cut them out. You know, uh -huh. and then, so it was cool. We used to order. We used to bulk order from Hong Kong. Yeah. And uh, that was my first experience. All my first import experiences were with bootleg stuff. Bootleg stuff. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, because we were poor. Back yeah, in the day. and I remember like some of the swamis here in Vegas had that bootleg that store. had like a store that kind of catered to like you know Japanese, Chinese, Korean toys. And I remember, I think it was a Korean company that had a, quite a bit of like um, you know bootleg Game Boy Advance games. They had a couple of like Sega games. Was it at the out. at the Broad Acre Swami? It actually it was actually. Um, the Swami that was fantastic indoor Swami. Not fantastic. There was one. Oh, I'm trying to think where. It was on the east side. Oh, man. Yeah, and they used to have a lot of stuff like that. And there was one on the one of the Swamis that my uncle used to work at. They had a whole bunch of that stuff as well as like Pokemon cards. They used to have all those like the pirate. Yeah, the pirate one. Yeah. And, like little Power Rangers there in the moon. Dragon Ball Z figures and stuff like that. I'm trying to remember this, the cross piece, but I don't, I can't think of it from my head. But my uncle and aunt used to work there, and I used to go visit them. And that's how I got in introduced to Neil Deal. At Swami? Yeah, at Swami. Like the arcade? Yeah. Because they had KOF 95, they had um, Bubble Bobble. 
and they had a whole bunch of other stuff. They had, you know, Street Fighter. Yeah. You can't have an arcade without Street Fighter. It's like, you know. You can't have a sandwich without hand, you know what I mean? <laughs> so it looks like we got a bunch of credits. Yeah. We're, we're, we're doing pretty good so far. Doing lives up there. Yeah. I feel like we're cheating to give ourselves more lives. But. Hey, but sometimes... But this you, game is hard. This game is hard. So if you want to make it far in this game, you know, you got to give yourself quite a few credits. and Well, you got to get good. Yeah, as much as I love this game, and I, I do play it as often as I can, good. I know it's one of those games that I'll never be able to, like, complete with one life. No <laughs> way. No. That's tough to make a beat. Yeah, I can... I mean... I'm decent at a few shmups, but like, there is no game that I can beat in like one city. No. You know, which is weird because I'm actually like, do you know the Toho games? I'm good at yeah. the Toho games. Mm -hmm. And those are like crazy when it crazy comes to like projectiles. Oh, okay. But for whatever reason, this game, it's because I can't see them. I can't see it them. Whoops your ass. Little missiles. And you got like all these debris. Yeah, debris and all these things to pick up, like these uh, navy blue little pallets. They actually go towards, uh, like, it's like a little bomb count, so you have to fill up the bomb count meter, and then it'll give you an extra bomb. And then you have your little um, green metals right there that increase the power-ups. You got the gold ones to add more points to your total score. So not a whole lot of variety when it comes to power-ups, you know, but you just pick up one thing to increase your firepower, pick up another thing to um, increase your bomb meter so you can get a certain amount of those and get your bomb ready to go for that boss. At least that makes it easier that we're different colored ships. Yeah. So we were just yeah, same because ship. earlier like we were the same ship, it was kind of hard to distinguish who was who, and I would get killed a lot from the way. And you're like, what the? Why what am I dying? dying? And then George would be like, you so. Shout out to George. Shout oh, out to the gorgeous George. one if you're watching this. It was good, man. The gorgeous one. Yeah. He's always trying to. I just want to rub his hair. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if you got no hair, I just want to rub on it. <laughs> oh. yeah, that guy is the master, man. He really what? Everything. Good? What's up? He's over here saying I suck. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I've never really seen him play like any old games. Yeah. I mean, I will say one of the certain types of games that I don't really shine on, and I'll admit this, are platformers. I've never been good at platformers, although I do enjoy them very much. I enjoy, you know, the Mario's, the Donkey Kong, you know, Adventure Island, Castlevania. I love those games, but I've never been that good at them. I'm alright with platformers, but that's kind of with most games. I feel like I'm alright with most yeah. games. There isn't like too many things I'm terrible at. Uh -huh. um, I have to say, first person shooters, I'm terrible at first person shooters. I mean, uh, the only reason why I play those is because of the Call of Duty Zombies mode. I've mean, been a big fan of those. I'm, I can hold my own on that. But as far as like online, uh, too much, you know, online first person shooter games, oh no way. I would not, I would not last a second. But. We're lasting kind of, of a long time here, though. We're doing pretty yeah. good. Not it's too bad. Pretty much until you die, too, though. Like, once yeah. you die, you lose all your power ups. That's when it gets And that's hard. when it gets hard. And, you know, that's how it is for a lot of shoot em up games. Once you get hit, you know, it's like one of those one hit KO, no health meter, nothing like that. You get hit once, you die, you lose all your power ups. You're going to have to pick them up again. And it gets really hard, especially once you progress through the game. You know? mm. It does get pretty tricky, which I do like a game that does um, give me a bit of challenge so I can kind of like progress through it and, you know, get a little bit better at it every time I play it. Pew, pew, pew. And this game is really good because it's hard, but it's not too like unforgiving to the, the point where you want to just put your controller down and just give up. Eh, it's hard. It's and hard. actually, I think the reason why we have all the lives is because we set it to extend every 100,000. Yeah. And that already has 600,000 points, so... Mm -hmm. But honestly, that kind of helps because... <laughs> Originally, it's the first 100,000 and then every 200,000. Yeah. So we're pretty much earning twice as many lives. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
What I'm gonna say, if you wanna beat this game, you kinda need that. <laughs> Especially no. multiplayer because single player it's pretty good, but multiplayer it, it can get pretty crazy. I feel it's... like we're playing some bitch mode right now. Nah. I mean if we would have picked the super easy mode, which you can play for all those newcomers to schmucks. You know, if you play easy. this game for the first time, you can play the super easy mode, so it's a little bit harder for you to die. I don't know, man. I, I never play easy on games. Like, I, I kind of like... I kind of feel like I have to when I first play a game, just to see how it feels. Yeah. And then once I, you know, I get good at it, okay, it's time to turn up the difficulty. And that's how you learn, you know. That's just how I get better, and George would say that you never get better. <laughs> right, yeah. You, you, George would be like, you don't get You don't get good. Unless you're playing you like yeah, or you know you're playing the, at least the normal mode. Mm -hmm. The only games I can think of that I ever played like low difficulties were like the rhythm games. You know, oh yeah, first well, starting those out. Be, yeah, because you know especially uh, playing a rhythm Jesus. game for the first time, you really have to learn the game mechanics, how it works, how the controls are, and then if it's a game that you do plan on playing a lot, you know you want to get better at it, so you have to you know kind of challenge yourself at it. Yeah. Yeah. Yeet. Without a doubt. Yeet. I mean, these, this is definitely one of those games along Blazing Star Ooh. that I've played a lot and I've beaten a few times. Just, just because I really enjoy the game. You know, I'm not good at it by any means. I'm, I guess, okay at best. Because I do die a lot. <laughs> but it's just one of those games I can just always pick up again and play and just have a great time with, you know. I feel like the gray spot on this game is really small, which is good because I feel like projectiles aren't making like direct contact. Like I think they have to hit you like right in the center. Yeah. For you to die. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I see. I see. Yeah, it like hit me right in the center. Yeah. So, you, so the hit protection like... isn't all like wonky. Oh, no. Oh, oh fuck. Ah! Special beater. Nice. I wouldn't say Satanic, Satanic Surfer. surfer. Alright, so we're in stage five. I like the, the song in this stage because it even though it doesn't really I felt like if they would have made this stage like a snow stage, mm -hmm. like a snow mountain, I, I feel like the song would fit better with the environment. Because like I do listen to this uh, soundtrack of the game quite a lot, you know, quite a bit. And this definitely is a good song for like a snow stage, I feel like. I mean, it's like weathery, like rain clouds and stuff. Yeah. All right, now I'm starting to die. Now uh, my suckiness starts to kick in. <laughs> I can to die. And I just opened my mouth, so you know I'm gonna die. Oh no. That's, just, that's how it works. No, you're doing pretty good. Like, oh, I didn't die. I didn't die. Yeah. Uh, nah, <laughs> Every other hit's gonna be. Gonna F me up. Ooh, as I almost run right into that missile. Yeah, I feel like the the gray spot or whatever the sensitive spot, the J spot, is right really there. small. Oh. Yeah. Which I think that's a, a good thing. Yeah. yeah. Makes it a little more forgiving. Yeah. Is that something? What is this? Look, we're chained together. Oh, oh look at that. That's cool. <laughs> Can you tell we rarely play two-player games? Right. It's hard nowadays, man, because like... Online, you know? Yeah. Online is the big thing. Everyone wants to play online. You know, and a lot of older gamers, like, we're grown-ass men, right? Like, it's, it's yeah. hard to, like, sit down and be like, oh, we're going to coordinate and play, and yeah. it's like, no, we, we have jobs and shit, and it's, it's hard. You know, you know, we both live pretty busy lives, you know? Mm -hmm. You know, we got DJ, he has a full-time job, and he's working on FX Union Yuki, and me, you know, I have a full-time job, and I have skate a skateboarding as a hobby, which keeps up a lot of my time, you know? Mm -hmm. And you know me, I'm very social, I like to go out and hang out with friends, hang out with you guys, you know, the gorgeous one. I don't know who you hanging play. out with. No, I play a lot. <laughs> but you ain't hanging out with me. What you mean? I'm here now. You ain't hanging out with me. Boy, I come to your house all the time. What you mean? I know. 
I don't leave the house a whole lot now. Yeah, uh, you know. Because <laughs> I work from home. Both things, I both jobs that I do require me to work from home. Yeah. So that's hard. I mean, me, I like to go out. Man. I like to go out. Oh, I do too. Adventure. Yeah, get it. When I can. Yeah. I mean, that's a nice thing. And, you know, I'm, you know, it's going to be a little surprise for some people, but, you know, I do play a little Pokemon Go. Being an adult is hard. I play a little Pokemon Go. It's fun. I like it. Pokemon Go f yourself right in the... Wow, really? I, I, you know, I gave it a chance. I gave Pokemon Go a chance. I, I mean, I, I like it. I, I like the fact... I can't. Oh. I can't because I'm old. I'm not still alive. Yeah, how am I... Look how at, am I still alive? We're huh. chained together again. Yeah. We're, we're interlocked. Oh, boy. I, I feel like I'm going to die a lot right here. <laughs> Apparently they were supposed to make a Harry Potter go, but I'm like, how the hell is that going to work? Oh yeah, Niantic is going to do it. Yeah, and I'm same, like, same company. good luck with that. <laughs> you still have a lot to fix with Pokemon Go. I mean, I like the game, but it can definitely use some improvement. Oh, there's a pile of those down. Oh, that's a... That's a... That's a... That's a... Bomb. I'm just using a bomb. You get the same thing. Give me a lot. Ah! Ooh! Oh! Oh! Stop it! Oh! Yeah! Dude, that was like... Super close. Slayer. Oh, more? Oh, crap. Do I have another bomb? I like that again. Yeah, right before I get hit, I fire off everything up. Except when I'm not paying attention. Oh no. Yeah, because if you fire off all your things, you can uh, destroy the projectile. Yeah. Oh, that's, that's what that's keeps me alive. <laughs> so every time I get my bomb, I'll just use it to kind of protect myself. Because if not, I would have been there and would have been like, you've been sucked. I'm like, you been sucking, son. Yeah. Oh, see that that's what that's what I keep doing and Oh uh, no! Oh me too! I just got F. Oh damn, how am I supposed to Oh oh right. oh oh yeah, should be okay. Should be Super Bomb! Yeah. Super. Oh Dang. whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, oh okay, now it's starting to This again. Shoot your missiles. I'm shooting everything I got. Then take a nap. Everything. Then fire the missiles. We're getting near the end. This stage is, oh man, brutal. Is it? Yeah. A lot of these stages are kind of brutal though. Have you lost any credits yet? I don't know. I doubt it. Yeah, I think if we had like, oh. normal livestock, we'd be dead. Yeah. Okay, so we still we only get three continues though, right? I think so. And so technically, we only get one continue because you you get no, we we get three credits and one continue because mm -hmm. we each use the credits to start the game. Yeah, and so. You just died, right? No, I just used my special. No, no, I mean, Oh yeah, I just continue. died. Yeah, I just. So died. then this is this is our last. This is our. Oh. Our final run. It's so hard. Oh, oh, oh my god, it's so hard to oh, do. Oh, oh, what? Oh, what? Oh, it's so hot right now. Oh yeah, funny. <laughs> Suddenly. What's going on? Suddenly, get get played. Yeah, look at that. Oh. oh. I'm just trying to like pay extra attention so I don't get hit with some random bullets. That's the thing, you really gotta pay attention to this game. I mean, just like a lot of stuff. Yeah, because the whole like... Every time I panic, I do that. I lay... Oh, what? 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 Oh, I died. Of course. Take my eyes off the TV for a second. Stay alive. Stay alive. Ah, 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 ah. Stay alive. Stay alive.
stay alive, purple lightning. What's the thing gonna be called from now? Purple lightning. Yeah, purple lightning. How about purple? Chocolate rain. <laughs> purple rain. I want to get those things, but missiles keep flying towards me. Stop! Oh. Stop shooting stuff. Oh! 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 God, oh! 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 Laser beams. You just got laser beams. Oh, I have a special arm. That's why that's what's protecting me. Oh shit! Oh! So fire off, like, fire off your thing whenever you think you're going to get hit. Yeah, that's what I've been doing. Like, because I've been trying to stay alive. Because... I'm so scared right now. I have two lives, and this is my one and only credit. You have four lives, Purple Lightning. This is my last credit. Stay alive. After this, I'm dead. Oh! No, 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 no! Fuck! Oh! Oh! Jesus. Luckily, it's kind of easy to avoid that. Yeah, because it's charging its lasers. It's like, I'm slow. I gotta charge my load. My laser. I gotta blow my load. I was like, oh! See, it's so easy to, like, get distracted by everything. You don't know where you're at for a quick second. You're like, oh! You know, and there's, like, a bit of slowdown that's kind of helping out. Yeah, it does. <laughs> I mean, unfortunately, a lot of games suffer from oh, slowdown. Oh, is how oh, it, is, but oh, it does kind of come to your advantage, so you can kind of prepare your next move, and you can see where the bullets are coming from. Para preparar, mira. Cabrón de mierda. ¡Ay, güey! Purple Lightning. Me dispararon que tú quieres que haga. Una perdió. Oh no! Fuck! Oh. Yeah, maybe we should like kill those. Kill the people in front. Or whatever's in front. I of kill us. you. <laughs> oh, oh, I, I, oh. I, cabrón. Oh, I, cabrón. I, Shoot oh. super laser! Oh no. Oh no. I oh, oh I feel like I'm gonna die oh. here. Oh kamikaze. Oh boy, kamikaze. Oh whoa. I'm sweating and I haven't even popped the Molly. What happened? Uh, oh Oh Is this the last boss? Oh, do the things, uh, do the ah no, I, I still died, thing. even I did the I did the two piece. I'm gonna do this two piece. I wanna say there's one more stage. Oh, hey, ah. for me. Oh, you boy, let's blow the other one. Take that, you little punk. Stop going on. Sorry. I was supposed to be in the How are you in here? Yeah. Oh. I can oh, do what yeah. I can to stay alive. I. Can you do it? Defeated. 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 Junkie monkey. Oh, I want to say this is the last stage. Because I know the last stage boss has a different song. Junkie Monkey. Because I know bo bosses uh, from the stage three and six, they should share the same music. Yeah. Uh, the other ones. Okay. Oh, we're both down to one one life here. Oh. Man, that is so much going on. Man. Oh! I know. Huh. Uh, oh, you're supposed to stay alive with me, purple I'm lightning. Trying. Ah, fuck! <laughs> you see, this game is not easy. And we're at the last stage too, so we're just. Are we? Yeah. No, this is our last life, so uh, hopefully we can do it. I doubt it. Whoa! Uh, oh! Stop it, you guys! Stop it! Stop shooting! You guys are playing fair. Bro, peace. Stop it! What's going on here? Oh no, we're 
We're getting attacked. Right? Yeah. Because it kind of looks like... Oh, no, I died! Oh! Oh, all right. Well, that was it. Oh, we got close, but... Yeah. We did really good. No cigar. We did really good, but yeah, unfortunately, we couldn't, we couldn't do it. Well, that's a shame. We couldn't do it, and that's going to mm -hmm. wrap up tonight's video. Yeah. It so, was fun, though. Yeah, right? that's a I enjoyed little it. bit of a that glimpse good... of the new Rev 2016 physical Battle Garega, which is an amazing shmup game. Obviously, not the perfect one, but for what it is, and from 1996... I gotta say it's pretty good. Yeah. I do enjoy it. Yeah, but, it's really good. Yeah, very fun. Fun to play. Really good, really hard. And hard. I don't know, I find I actually think it's 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 a lot easier to play two player. Like we were complaining about the screen thing, mm -hmm. but I found staying alive a lot easier playing with somebody else. Yeah. <laughs> So yeah, you really have to hype each other up to do yeah. so. Yeah, and so. you actually get used to the screen. Yeah, thing you too. get used to it. You know, once you play it a couple yeah. times, it's the beginning like it's like ah, stop yeah, moving. Yeah, it kind of throws you off, and but. then you know you're like, I <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's not too bad. Yeah, but what very good overall. Uh, so I want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys want to see more con like con oh, Jesus, hold on, let me do this again. So I want to thank you guys very, very much for watching. If you want to see more content like this, please let me know. Drop a comment down below and be sure to subscribe. And also, please do yourself a favor and head on over to Saru Mano's channel, Retro Jipong. Check it out. He has a lot of awesome content. What kind of content can they find on your channel, sir? Uh, mostly import gaming stuff, you know, like um, old Japanese retro stuff. Um, I draw a lot of video game art on there, too. And uh, just like Adventures in Japan and stuff like that. So a lot of Japanese-centric stuff on my channel. So mm. if you guys want to check it out, check out YouTube.com forward slash Sarumaru to check out my channel. Yeah, if you want to look into more about Japanese gaming as far as, you know, buy, sell, and trading... Um, showing off your import collection. If you're also an import collector, be sure to hit us up on Facebook. Yeah, on the check Retro out our, our group. Our Retro Jeepong group, and we also have a buy, sell, and trade if you want to uh, participate in that yes, as well. Yes, we, we recently opened up the buy, sell, trade, the Retro Japan mar Marketplace. Yeah, so definitely check that out. Which is getting a lot of members. Did you yeah, see we're it's, getting quite a bit of uh, people joining in. We just in. opened it, and it's already like two, almost 200 members. Yeah, so you and know, Retro Japan is almost at a thousand. I so. know. I was like, God damn, we're getting popular. Yeah, we get in there. We get in there, and uh, little by little. Yeah, be sure to subscribe to both our channels. You know me. I'm gonna try to do as much as I can to provide um, a lot of content for you guys. Not just pickups. You know, let's plays like this, reviews, unboxings, and so much more. So thank you guys so much once again. Yeah, for let them, let them, ask them to let, to let you know if um, if they like these let's plays. We can yeah. Do more if of you them. if you like the video, uh, please let us know so we can definitely work on more videos like this and also have a couple other people that I'm good friends with to join along with me on this uh, let's play videos. But you know you'll definitely see Sarumaru a lot more. On my channel, and you'll definitely see me on his channel, mm -hmm. since we have been doing a, quite a bit of collabs lately, oh, yeah. and I, I love doing collabs with other YouTubers, and it really makes things very interesting, and yeah, just to have someone else on the channel yeah, it's a lot of fun. brings a lot of excitement, and just new content for you guys, so thank you so much, like I said, thank you so much for everyone for checking out the video. And thank you, Saramar, for joining me on this video yeah, for man. Let's Play. Anytime. Yeah, we'll definitely have to do more of these. But until then, this is your friendly Cuban gamer, Crazy Gabano, and with one and only Saru Maru. Thanks for checking out the video, guys, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Later.